the new news, she's slaying the city. No makeup, just wake up and still giving the free. Get the lights, camera, and she cuts as big as a movie. And grab a seat and now tune with disastrous beauty. Hello, folks. It's your girl, Disastrous Beauty, coming back with another voiceover. So the unit I will be reviewing today was sent to me by the Doula Hair. Shout out to Una Doula for sending me this unit. I truly do appreciate it. As you guys can see, this is from Christmas, okay? But shout out to them for being patient with me and uh, giving me the time to kind of get myself together after the holidays and do this video. I truly do appreciate it. So this video is a little bit different. Um, right here, I am showing you guys the hair. It is a 28 eight inch uh, closure unit. It's a body wave wig, but I'm gonna be bleaching the knots on this unit first before I do anything. So right here, I am using a 40 volume developer and I am also gonna be using the Clairol um, bleaching powder. And I basically mix it until I get to sort of a toothpaste consistency. <laughs> Uh, and I do that so it doesn't bleach the hair. Sometimes I get it right, sometimes I don't, y'all, okay? I am kind of new to this, so just bear with me, girl, okay? Just bear with me. But I wanted to kind of show you guys my process. So right here, as I stated, this is a, a closure wig. It is a 5x5 five five, uh, HD lace closure. So I put that on there and I let it sit for uh, 15 minutes. Sometimes I let it sit um, in two increments of 15 minutes but this one only needed 15 minutes so that's what i did and then i am gonna go in with my uh shimmer lights uh purple shampoo so that's what i'm doing here and then i also go in with the conditioner the shimmer lights conditioner as well and that's kind of to take out that orangey sort of look so i want to show you guys what that looked like that's what I did. And then I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna tweeze this unit a little bit. I didn't tweeze it a whole lot because if you watch me, then you know tweezing isn't necessarily my forte. I have been working on it and I'm getting better and better with time, girl, okay? Practice makes perfect. So I did tweeze it, but I didn't wanna go overboard because I do have a tendency to end up with ball spots, okay? And I didn't want that with this unit because your girl was feeling this unit. So that's what I'm doing here. I am tweezing it some. This unit uh, was very, very dense. The hairline was extremely dense. So I tweezed it some, I didn't tweeze it excessively. Uh, but if you do choose to get this unit, you may wanna tweeze it to your liking. Like to me, like I said, I was playing it safe, but you know, you do what you do, girl. But anyways, the rest is pretty much self-explanatory. It's the same old, same old that I do. Other than this part right here, I want to tell you guys this right here. If you want those really, really full voluminous curls that you're gonna see that I got with this unit, what I did was the pin curl method. So I uh, wand curled it with my curling iron and then I applied pins or uh, whatever you use. Sometimes I'll use bobby pins. Right here I'm using these little clips that you can get from the beauty supply store. And I do that and I curl the unit and I ended up letting it sit for maybe about four hours because Journey had an eye doctor appointment. I let it sit about four hours and then I came back and took it down and you can get those very full curls that I always have with body wave wigs. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and let you guys get into this music and then I will see you love bugs in the outro. Bye! You love it when I get so high and drop that thing so low Make you sit right here Now you can't go back home You love it when I get so high and drop that thing so low Make you sit right here Now you can't go back home You love it when I get so high and drop that thing so low Make you sit right here Now you can't go back home You love it when I get so high And drop that thing so low Make you sit right here Now you can't go back home I I'm drank up and I'm banked up And I'm fade faded You bend it down and you poke it up And you elevate it I'm drank up and I'm banked up And I'm fade faded You bend it down and you poke it up And you elevate it you I came over, I ain't sober, I'm still drunk, that's hangover Might run it back when this page over, you the best thing I done slaved over, gon' arch you back and been way over It's overdue for that understressing, over him now you underdressing Call me up and I come finessing like, ooh, we shot it, what it do, what it don't Baby, you a queen, you can move how you want You was rocking with me when I couldn't stay afloat They ain't never saying nothing, wavy to a boat Like, eyes up, look at me, now I'm the captain Brought the camera, time for action, split the legs just like a fraction Tuck the napkin, time for snacking, you a mother...
meal Tell me that it's mine, baby, tell me that it's real Hit it to the max, well, tell me how it feel It's gonna be a minute, cause I'm in it for the thrill Make her feel like heaven, she gon' put me in the wheel And willingly, I wanna do anything she wanna do I ain't even wanna boo, but this is what the karma do It's hard to be apart from you, cause ooh, I Love it when I get so high And drop that thing so low Make you sit right here Now you can't go back home, you Love it when I get so high And drop that thing so low Make you sit right here, no You can't go back home, I I'm drank up and I'm danked up and I'm faded, faded You bend it down and you poke it up and you elevate it I'm drank up and I'm danked up and I'm faded, faded You bend it down and you poke it up and you elevate it Webs or something with this unit that is not the case. 
Uh, as far as shed and tangling with this wig, Stroud the Packaging, she did none of the things. Uh, that's not to say at some point she won't shed, but Stroud the Packaging, she didn't. Now, I was getting some tangles later on, like after I had curled it, but that was team my bad just because of the way that I had pin curled the unit. Because the unit was not uh, tangly before that. So, I want to throw it out there because you may have seen me just doing that, but I know it was because of how I pin curled it because I was so, sort of in a rush. So, yeah, that is pretty much it as far as uh, the details and specs go with this wig. Now, if you're interested in my pros and cons, then please continue to watch. Okay, so my cons with this wig is that it did not come tweezed, really. And also that it did not come bleached at all. Those are my cons with this unit. Uh, I was going to say it's frizzy, but I think that is a team my bad. I don't think it's a team their bad. I'm not 100% sure. But those are my cons with it because, you know, it, it had to be tweezed. And honestly, I feel like it could stand to be tweezed a little more. But, child, when I, when I do too much tweezing, I end up... It, it, it ends up bald okay <laughs> now i did definitely bleach the knots and i feel like with this particular one in order for it to, to give a more realistic or more natural effect you would definitely have to bleach it so those are my cons with this unit now my pros are child i think the hair is gorgeous the hair feels gorgeous i feel like the hair looks gorgeous i i it held the curl so nice honey maybe a little too nice okay because i pin curled it this morning took Jern to her eye doctor appointment, came back, took them down, and honey, they were curling. Them things were thanging. You know what I'm saying? So, that is definitely a plus to me. Uh, I also love the fact there's a 5x5 five five closure, and I love the lace in general. I feel like the lace definitely melted really, really nicely, in my opinion. So, yeah, those are my pros with old girl. Can I recommend this wig? In my opinion, yes. I think this unit is just gorgeous. I love it. I think it's an effortless slate, especially for my girls that, you know, are on the go and they still want to be cute if you're busy or whatever. You, you drop the kids off real quick. You can get cute real quick. This is the perfect go-to. It just gives me that. This is going to be a good date night wig. And if even if you don't get it as long as I have it, it can still be a date night wig or it can be an everyday wig. It just depends on you. But, yeah, I would definitely, definitely recommend Oh Girl. All right, so let me give you guys this full 360 so we can wrap this thing all the way up. So this is obviously the unit in the front. This is it on the left side. This is it in the back. Keep in mind, I am 5'4". And this is it on the right side. So yeah, child. So yeah, y'all, that is pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know if you are feeling this unit as much as I am. I am interested in hearing you guys' thoughts and opinions down below in the comments. Um, if you are interested in it, I will have a direct link to this unit down below in the description box for your convenience. And once again, shout out you to shout out to you, Nadula, for sending me this unit and sponsoring this video. And your yeah, girl, that's all. That's all. So, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions that you feel like I may have left out, feel free to comment down below. And if you're not already subscribed, girl, click the subscribe, but it's not going to cost you about one red cent. And if you're not already following me on all my social media platforms, I am Disastrous Beauty on both IG and TikTok. I'm Helton Misty on Snapchat, and I'm Disastrous B on Twitter. And I will see you, love folks, next time.